Is there an easy way to help your sweetie pie be clean and sanitary during her heat? First of all, if you're new to Sweetie Pie Pets, please like and subscribe. We're growing faster and faster, and I owe it all to you guys. And if you want to be alerted every time I put out a new video, click the little bell symbol for notifications. We release videos twice a week. So mature female dogs go into heat about every six months. I have a great video here if you'd like to learn more about dog heat cycles. If your Sweetie Pie has been fixed, also known as spaying, then she will not have a heat. But keep in mind that a full hysterectomy also eliminates a lot of the hormones that your Sweetie Pie needs. And you can watch my video on that right here. So today I have Amika with me. She lives with my affiliate family, Melissa and Garrett, and their four kids and their other Sweetie Pies. Hi Amiko, can you say hello to the world? Amiko is in heat at the moment. So when your Sweetie Pie goes into heat, you'll notice that she needs to clean herself a lot more than usual. And I mean, a lot more. And this is normal. She'll need a lot of grooming to keep herself clean. And unfortunately, I've seen some people yell at their Sweetie Pies just because she's cleaning more than usual and maybe it makes them uncomfortable. Don't. Please do not yell at your Sweetie Pie for grooming herself. It's normal and it's natural. And she doesn't have opposable thumbs. Amiko, did you have opposable thumbs? She's already under enough stress and you just need to let her do her job, please. But if you're concerned about the cleanliness of your own house, your bed, the couch, the carpet, then this is a product you might wanna check out. It's a female dog diaper. And we have three of them that we're gonna try out today. So first of all, make sure to check out my Amazon store for all these products that I try out. It's at amazon.com slash shop slash sweetie pie pets. Nobody's paying me to talk about these diapers today, but I do get a few pennies if any of you order them off my Amazon store. And I do mean a few cents. So the first pair of diapers that she's already wearing is called the Cute Bone Reusable Female Diaper. And right now it's $14.99 for a three pack. So this pair she's already been wearing for a couple days and it works really, really well. It has Velcro, so it's adjustable. And sometimes they don't really like wearing them and they try to kind of scrape their back up against something so that they can scoot it off. But so far she has not been able to remove this diaper at all. So I really am happy with it. I'm just gonna take it off to kind of show it to you guys. So believe it or not, girl diapers and boy diapers are very different. And you have to pay attention to whether or not you have a girl diaper, which has a hole for their tail, versus a boy diaper, which would just be a belly band. And that would not work in this case. So this diaper is great. It just has a Velcro, like I said, and it's sort of adjustable. This is the extra small, by the way, and it fits Amico great. So the diaper is washable if you get anything on it, but it's really cool because you can wear it for several days without her getting anything on it. All you have to do is get a little panty liner and it's too big for her, so you can just cut it in half. What is that? And then you have one for now and one for later, and it just sticks right on there. Voila! So the cute bone diapers are very functional and they work great and they have a cute pattern, but I wanted to try something even more cute. So I decided to try the funny dog skirt with female diapers and suspenders. Now so far I have no idea if this is gonna be as functional as the other ones, but it sure is cute. So this one basically operates with the same approach. It has the hole for the tail, and then, you know, it's not really that the diaper itself is absorbent. You're supposed to put a little panty liner on there to absorb anything that you need to absorb. And this one I'm noticing right now does not have Velcro, so it is a little bit adjustable right here with this strap. I'm wondering if she'll be able to get it off. Let's check it out. Oh, it's a snap. Ouch. Okay, so it crosses on her back. Yeah, across and then around her chest. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. It's actually easier than I thought. It just kind of wraps around her neck, which hopefully doesn't choke her. And supposedly it, it holds them up so they don't fall down. How cute is that? Amika, did you have a cute pair of diapers on? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love it so much. It has a little bow right there and her little suspenders. Are you so pretty on your period? <laughs> wow, I'm actually really impressed with this. And although it doesn't feel quite as secure as the other one, you know, because it doesn't have Velcro and it's a little looser, but I do think the suspenders will help to make it so that she can't get them off. Wow, I'm so proud of you. Now keep in mind that you're not likely gonna wanna keep a pair of diapers on your Sweetie Pie the entire time she's in heat. She's not gonna like it too much and she needs to clean herself. And this thing just gets in the way. Also, she's gonna need potty breaks and this is in the way, she can't go to the bathroom. But these are absolutely a great option for bedtime, couch time, or just sitting on your lap. So the other pair of diapers that I'm checking out today is the Green Cupcake. 
Now this one has suspenders also, and it has a cute little flower in the back. And again, it operates under the same premise that this is washable, but you need a panty liner. This one doesn't have any Velcro or snaps at all on the side. It's just sort of elastic. So it seems to me like it might be a little more difficult to get it on, but let's see. Oh, the snaps are up on the straps. I see, okay. So she has to step in from the bottom. Miko, put your diaper on. This one's definitely harder to put on. It's got sort of this bib thing underneath and the snaps are around here. So it's definitely a little harder to put on. But once I got it on, it's absolutely adorable. You look so cute. The front side is like this little apron. It goes all the way down. I'm sure it's just more annoyance for poor Amiko. Amiko, am I so annoying? I'm sorry, you're such a good sport. So uh, even though it took me a few minutes to figure out how to get this on, I do think it's very secure. Fits her just fine. Amika weighs, I think about four and a half pounds, maybe five pounds. These fit great. I don't think she can get them off. I think all three of them get two thumbs up. So the question is whether or not these will provide some protection from the boys against pregnancy. And yes, I do think they would provide some protection, but as I said before, they're not a condom. So you still have to keep a close eye if your female goes into heat. So thanks you guys for watching, and if you have any thoughts or comments on female doggy diapers, please leave them in the comments below. We'll see you guys next time on Sweetie Pie Pets. Bye-bye. She's so stylish and fashionable.